All right, David Can here with another question from topic 2.1 motion. Uh, this is another IB question. We have a skydiver with a mass of 50 kilograms falling vertically with a constant speed of 50 meters per second. Now, I skipped a very important word there. I'm going to highlight it in a different color. Constant speed. Constant speed means that the skydiver has achieved terminal velocity. They're no longer accelerating. They're falling towards Earth as fast as they're going to fall towards Earth. The question asks for the upward force acting on the skydiver. All right. Well, as the skydiver is traveling with a constant speed, that means he's in or she is in equilibrium. What that means is that all the forces on the skydiver balance. So let's treat this, this skydiver as a point. What are the forces acting on him or her? Well, the first one that comes to mind is his or her weight. Their weight is the force that attracts them towards the Earth. It's, it's the force of gravity. And that's what accelerates them in the first place. But if they've reached a constant speed, that means that there must be some other force acting in the opposite direction to balance the weight. And that other force is going to be air resistance. And that's what we want, the upward force of air resistance. Now, if the speed is constant, then F and W are equal, which means F equals the weight, which is calculated as M G. The mass of the skydiver is given as 80 meters or 80 kilograms, and the acceleration due to gravity will take at 10 meters per second squared for a total of 800 newtons.